Dixie State students, faculty, and staff volunteered their time and energy to help students move into the campus's newest and largest housing facility yet. The new residents lined up outside the five-story building, allowing volunteers to unload their belongings into carts and wagons. It's actually really nice to have everybody help. I had me and my cousin yesterday just pack both of these cars all together, <laughs> so it, it was really nice to have a lot of people just to help. Besides suitcases of clothes, bedding, and items to be used for studies, the most popular items transferred into the building were mini fridges. It took a lot of coordination to make this move-in day easy and practically seamless for the new students, most of which are freshmen. And throughout the day you'll see people trickling in because they value uh, assisting our students and it's a great way for our students to meet the different individuals and hands that help them throughout the year. Campus View Suites 2 is the largest on-campus housing. This 140,000 square foot complex offers suite style living with up to six students in each suite. We have 92 apartments here and 534 students that have reservations. And it's a big ordeal to try and get everyone and their families not only a key but all their belongings up into their rooms. Each suite features a shared living space, two restrooms, and a kitchenette, with some single rooms for extra privacy. It's a private room means there's only one individual occupying that room. Shared room, there's two individuals. And the beds, they're lofted. Underneath the bed, you'll have a desk, dresser drawer, and pedestal. So there's not someone sleeping underneath the bed, it's just lofted with a workspace underneath and a ladder chest so that they can access the bed. And the ladder chest also has drawers built in that provides additional storage. Every other floor is designed to accommodate either male or female students. Because dorm space is shared, it's also considerably less to rent than an apartment. Private room, depending on where you live, that could be anywhere from $450 up to $600 a month. You're in a shared room, that could be $250 to $375, depending on where you live, and that's a monthly rate. Even those students who have lived in other campus housing say this is by far the best. I think both buildings definitely have their positives and negatives. I like that this building has full-size beds. Um, I think the living room and kitchen area, there's a lot more space. Um, bedrooms seem a lot smaller, but it's probably just because of the full-size bed. The closet's definitely bigger, which is nice. With laundry facilities located on each floor, students can easily walk down the hall and toss in a load at no charge. My sister has been staying with me. She helped me move in, so I'm doing her laundry while she makes my bed. Besides a great view, the facility also includes a large courtyard, pickleball courts, a hammock garden, fitness room lounges, and a community kitchen. On each floor, there's a community kitchen space. If they're wanting to bake or fry, they go to that area. But inside their apartment, they have a microwave, a French door, fridge and freezer, cabinet space, sink. Um, just if they want to cook something, they go to the community room and, and do it there. Lines to register inside were just as long as outside. Students in line were getting to know each other already. It's so nice. So nice. <laughs> I love it. I'm excited. I'm really excited. It'll be a good year. Many students coming to Dixie say they are happy to begin their new year with in-person classes instead of online courses. Well, uh, originally it was their concurrent enrollment program through uh, Utah Online High School. I actually graduated here at campus and then because I had experiences with them, I was able to get a uh, scholarship here and I decided to go ahead and uh, take it out here and come attend. I am pretty excited to join Dixie here. Uh, I have done college classes, but I'm excited to get the full college experience, you know, tour around. You know, this is my first time leaving the house, so I am looking forward to branching off and becoming my own person. The brand new smell inside the brand new campus building creates excitement among newcomers as the Dixie life has now become their destination. From Dixie State University, Melissa Anderson, Community Education News.